Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Doka Metal video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the... Well, the long story short, we're going to be taking a look at the memorable battle against Broly. This is the final memorable battle uh, that we'll probably have, I believe, this celebration, although you never know. But uh, this again follows the same trend that all the memorable battles have been following so far. So basically short, sweet, hard hitting and that's really about it. Uh, which I think has contributed a little bit to some of the fatigue players are feeling, but we'll talk about that in another video. But basically uh, Burly, you know, 400k attack, 400k defense, 65% damage reduction. Uh, he can stun you, uh, he also does 1.4 million super, but he has attack and defense of 150% boost. So though it's a 1.4 million super, uh, in the beginning of the fight it's actually a lot higher. It's like closer to 3, 3 million. And that's really your struggle here. Your struggle here is essentially making sure that you can start to hit him so that you can start to lower his attack and defense. For every single attack that you do, his attack and defense will go down uh, by 3%. So essentially... For every single attack that you do, uh, he will become progressively easier to handle. Now, of course, this is great, uh, and he does recover HP. You know, he does lock in place, and we'll talk about that now. But that means you want to bring units that do multiple super attacks. Multiple supers or multiple normal attacks. Doesn't have to be anything, uh, like, crazy. But hitting, for example, like if each unit hits three supers, that's a whole 30% knocked off of his boost already, uh, which is pretty helpful. So your main goal here is to bring units that can do uh, multiple supers. So that's, as you can see here, we're going for the Super Saiyan team to be thematic. But as you can see here, you know, that includes units like Super Saiyan Gohan, Super Saiyan uh, Gogeta, uh, the Super Saiyan Trio, because these units will do multiple super attacks. And this will bring Burly down a lot in terms of his attack and defense stats. And basically uh, will give you like big uh, kind of boosts, you know, in terms of being able to handle Burly. You can't knock his boost all the way down. Uh, you can't knock it down from 150% to zero, but you can knock it down to like 60%, which makes him way more manageable. And if you manage to get off like enough supers early on, Generally speaking, you'll be at the point where you'll probably be close to beating him and he won't have like a huge impact against you. Aside from that, there's really not too much else uh, to kind of deal with. He can only really fire one super attack per turn. He is uh, quite prone to super attacking quite early on. But it's really the locking in place that's the big problem. So Broly can lock in place. It is one of the least favorite mechanics of players for a very large reason. Uh, locking in place is the absolute worst mechanic that players have to deal with because it removes the player agency. So it removes your ability to, um, you know, like kind of deal with what's actually happening. Uh, so I think like for a lot of players, it's one of the worst mechanics. I do uh, agree to a certain point as well. It is probably my least favorite mechanic. Definitely, it's up there. If not, it is. And this can cause you problems. So generally speaking, you may find that you have one or two runs that are kind of ended uh, by the fact that you, you know, run out of, like you have the wrong units get locked in place. Now, of course, we have to complete the missions as well. And those require us to use one character of each type and also require us to... Um, do without items, which isn't too difficult. Um, like this team here got it done. But this is a very nice team. So we, you know, we have like Tech. Um, we have Tech Goku. Obviously, great for a lot of reasons. His revive is the big reason that we bring him uh, because of how much it helps us. So like you're gonna see now how helpful a revive can be. But yeah, Tech Goku for his revive, uh, physical Gogeta because multiple attacks, type advantage, very strong unit. You got the taunt, the intercept that you can use later on. Uh, Int, LR, Super Saiyan Trio, very, very good. Nice collection of units, uh, very strong. Again, also lots of multiple super attacks as well. Uh, very helpful group of units. 
uh, you know, that can do good damage as well. Um, we have AGL Spirit Bomb Goku, probably the more left field pick. Uh, he's okay. If he gets locked first slot, we are in a bit of trouble, but generally speaking, he should be fine. Then we have Strength Future Gohan, uh, who's really awesome still and does great because of the new addition of the physical uh, like team. And then we have Physical Super Saiyan Trunks, also really good in this situation because of the fact that he does multiple super attacks, uh, he's got type advantage, so we're getting everything we need. Remember, we, we're looking for multiple supers to bring Broly's attack and defense down, and yeah, just everything kind of working as required. But yeah, obviously friend lead, we took the physical SS trio and their standby skill does a lot of damage. So we also had a pretty good chance there and got everything done. But ultimately, really a good run uh, and a really good little event. But again, just kind of following the trend of short and sweet. And I think, yeah, um, nothing too crazy here. Should be able to get done. Bye.